Uh, welcome back to part 2 of my tutorial. Um, let's take a look at what we have already. Uh, we created the image container. We filled it with an alpha color, so it's all transparent. We copied the background image on it, and we copied the QR code image on it, and we positioned the QR code image in the center of the picture. So this is what we have. Now, next we want to get rid of the white background on the QR image. And we have a little problem with this, because um, you can't tell the QR server API um, to have no background. You can change the background color, but you can't say make it transparent. Um, we could fill it with a yellow color, but uh, as you can probably see, we have a slight gradient here in the background of the image. So we need to set it transparent in any way. For this, um, let's use the filter options of PHP. Um, they're called image layer effects. And um, if you tell an image to have an image layer effect, everything you copy on it will use this image layer effect. Now, before we do the copying of the QR code, let's call image layer effect. We want it to be on the image container. And we want to use the effect image effect overlay. Now this is an effect which is similar to the overlay effect in Photoshop. If we now take a look at it, loads a bit longer, okay. You can see that everything that is black has darkened down the background image and everything that is white has brightened up the background image. Now if we want um, the white to be invisible it um, it has to be some uh, some neutral gray and we can do this by calling the QR server API with um, another parameter called BG color and we want the background to be in 80 80 80 so that's a neutral gray now let's take a look at this again okay the white is all gone it seems transparent now by using the effect but the black is um, in a very low contrast so this doesn't look very good and you wouldn't be able to scan this with the phone. Um, most phones wouldn't recognize this, this QR code. So what we're going to do now is we're going to copy um, the QR image a few times um, over the, the background layer. So let's make a for loop. lower than 3 dollar i plus plus so this is gonna copy the QR code three times onto our image container and here we go this is what we wanted um, our warning sign with a nice QR code on it rendered by a PHP file and this can be downloaded as a PNG file. You can print this on t-shirts, you could print this um, on anything you want, you could use this in, in web pages. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, I'm gonna put a link to the script um, in the show notes. Um, there will also be a link to the background.png, you can download this for free. So you can use this code in any way you want it. would be nice if you would mention me if you use it, um, but you don't have to. Um, if you got some questions or some remarks or something else, put it um, down here in the comments. It would be nice to hear from you and it would be fine if you come up with some own ideas um, how to make it. You could make um, some grungy styles with your Flickr images or whatever. Um, I'm always interested in what you're doing with this. Okay, thanks a lot for stopping by and see you next time. Bye bye.